Hey guys, this is Rohit and the most awaited marshmallow update for OnePlus X has finally arrived and it is also official, also called as Oxygen 3.1.2. So let us start with the boot animation. I will guide you to the new features and tweaks given by them. So we are waiting for phone to reboot. The boot animation has changed and it, and it indicates that the two electrons are moving around the nucleus atoms and the two, two electrons is also the valency of oxygen. So hence they have stated that it is an oxygen OS. We are waiting. And finally it has been booted up. So this is my Samsung card or Samsung memory card. So you can just go right here and explore it. We'll show it later. Okay. First of all, uh, when you see on the lock screen, the uh, the time has been made in the bold. Bold that is uh, home. That is, it is modified and it looks bold. So we'll move on to the home screen. Here is the vertical scrolling, uh, which is a trademark of Marshmallow. We are waiting for apps to load. The apps are loading, so we will uh, require four to five minutes. So uh, the first feature, it is a. Uh, the customize you can just hit it and you will get the new options like enable shelf quick search and quick notification for you so you can just save them right here and move on so all my apps have been loaded and they are ready so let's start you can change the wallpapers from this on a single screen this is the wallpaper of the lock screen you can change it by selecting any wallpaper and you can change the home screen wallpaper also. So moving on to the mo most important it is the vertical scrolling and you've got a search bar at the top. So we will move on to the uh, apps right apps. So first of all I'll launch the WhatsApp. I will launch two or three apps to show you what uh, new features have been added. Calculator and calendar. So when you uh, have the recent button, so they will uh, look like this. And uh, right here in the right top corner, there is something called lock. You can just lock them. And just uh, there is the th three new op options introduced on the bottom. This is the app management, this is the uh, RAM cleaning and this one is the dismissal. So when you have locked some app and you clear dismissal, the app remains in the window and the background process is still active. So you can just remove it. Again you can clear the RAM by pressing this uh, broom icon and it will say that it will clear all the background processes. So I'll just click OK and it says all clear. So that one is the new feature we have been waited for and I don't see the multi window options here guys. I was really hoping that oxygen could bring it and uh, I'm sure they will bring it in the next update. So now we go to the most important that is the settings. So everything is uh, quite intact in the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, SIM card, mobile network, data usage and more. Home is also quite good. So there is new things have been introduced in the uh, display. So we'll just hit the display. And there is something called color balance. You can balance the color as RGB. And a new feature that has been added is uh, press power button twice for camera. So when you off your device and you want an instant camera, you can just press power button two times and your camera starts. So that is the new feature added by OnePlus. Many more uh, features we have been uh, waiting and they will eventually add up in this oxygen OS so next thing uh, the alert slider has been improved with uh, with the individual uh, toggle on and off for everything you can just on and off according to your priority same goes for silent one 
next thing is the new storage interface so this is the internal storage used it will show which apps images videos audios and other are been in the internal memory so we are waiting for them for calculation so that's right the apps are 9.34 gb yeah these apps are in the uh, actually these are apps are in the external storage because uh, they have said the storage used is samsung sd card but i don't know why they are present in the internal so eventually they will fix it and here is your samsung sd card you can uh, browse from there and uh, most important thing guys when you hit apps in the uh, lollipop you you had three options like running in sd card and internal but uh, here there aren't any options here is the all apps enabled and disabled so that is quite worst feature of this uh, rom guys i am hoping they could change and bring the running and internal and external sd card apps in this section so we are moving on to the new re newly introduced option called memory <clears throat> they will uh, it will just indicate which apps have been using your memory and for how long they have been using so you can just disable them or force stop them when you don't need them there is nothing uh, quite impressive in the battery uh, i am really waiting for the battery backup to be tested and i will just uh, tell you also how much the battery last nothing good in customization nor in buttons nor in gestures and location is uh, as it is security is good and that was end guys uh, there is nothing quite new more than this but also this rom has been uh, quite impressive to me and i'll just show you that it is really a marshmallow so thank you guys for watching the video and uh, stay tuned and stay, stay subscribed to my channel. Thank you for watching.